Now, in a commercial situation, medication is a very important facet of fish keeping. But as a home hobbyist, I believe only in medicating if I see fit to medicate. I will medicate for a reason. I don't just medicate for fun. Because there's always a downside to medicating. If you are gonna get happy and you just wanna medicate for the sake of medicating, it's better to go for some of the more natural, less chemical-based medications, whether it be Vugal or anything along those lines. As far as proper medications are concerned, I tend to leave the administering of proper medications to when you actually need them. So what I will do is always quarantine fish before they go into a display tank. When I quarantine my fish, I'll set up an appropriately sized aquarium with a low salinity. I'll introduce the fish. I'll leave them there for one month. That one month will give them time to display any issues that they may break out with as a result of any stress that may have occurred on the way to you. Then if the fish are all looking good and healthy and feeding and happy after one month, and then you slowly raise the salinity and everything looks good, then by all means, put them into the display tank. If on the other hand, during the quarantine time, the fish have cracked out with a, an infection, then you have the opportunity to fix that infection before it goes into the main aquarium. So there are specific medications for specific problems. If it's parasitic, you'll use a certain medication. If it's a fluke, a certain medication. If it's a bacterial, a certain medication, and so on. So in your quarantine tank, if your fish cracks out with something, I'd get a sample of your water and a video of your tank running, including the fish, down to your local aquarium expert so they can help you diagnose what is wrong with the fish. Then they can recommend medications that may work for what they see. And then once you've got your fish looking good, you then give it a full month to make sure the fish are happy. Six weeks is better, eight weeks is better than that. Once you're confident the fish are happy, you then can raise the fish into full salinity, ensure that they are happy, healthy and feeding, and then look at introducing them into the main tank again. So once again, I will not go throwing medications into my display tank for almost any reason. I will only medicate in a quarantine tank and I will not recommend medicating a quarantine tank unless I see fit to because there's always some downside to the medication. And if you can have healthy, happy fish through a basic quarantine protocol, then your fish are gonna be in the best stead. Also, if you are using various medications too regularly, the pathogens and so forth are able to build up some level of to tolerance to it. So anyway, Put a little note on the bottom of this video. Um, what medications have you had a lot of success with? What are your philosophies with medicating? Are you a guy that just medicates for the fun of it? Or do you take my approach, which is medicate if you see reason to medicate? Either way, quarantining is the key.